reading online somewhere. I can't remember if it was on Twitter or Reddit, but about these really cheap um, garden solar lights. And somebody said that all the Christmas ones were being clearanced for like $2 somewhere. Well, there's a Dollar General right around the store, right around the corner from my house. And in their uh, hardware aisle, they sell these ones, the Open Trail Plastic Solar Stake Light, for a dollar all year long. So I thought I'd go grab one and we would take it apart because the poster who had originally mentioned it said that these contain a jewel thief which is a specific type of a boost converter and also uh, a nice little solar panel. Now I've had this home now for like five minutes, charged it under an LED light and you know, as you can see it's lit up. So let's uh, take it to bits as Big Clive likes to say and see what there is to see. There could be a handy little boost converter circuit in here. If there is, well, that would be very cool. And if not, we will just uh, see what it's made from, right? So let's start by pulling the battery out of here. Let me zoom out a little bit so I can keep more of this in frame. All right, we start off with a triple A NICAD 200 milliamp hours from the Jiangsu Huying Power Co. Limited. Oh, made in China. What do you know? Uh, really quite modular. Yep. Well, there's definitely no um, jewel thief here. Let's zoom in and take a look at the circuit. What we've got is a resistor red blue brown so that's two six one 261 ohms that's that's a little strange an LED and a transistor Let's see if we can zoom in on that transistor. Try it like this. Y X B O S five W eight two seven. Well, that's not a transistor. It's actually got a uh, four legs to it. Give me a second, let me look that up. All right, the only information that I can find is it's a linear voltage regulator, but that's really it. So, I figured next we would detach the solar panel and see what it's putting out. So, let me zoom out here. And since I have 
zero intentions of using this. I'm just going to nip these wires here. I'm not going to bother desoldering them. If I could get this out, that would be ideal. I mean, I know I can get it out. It's just a matter of how hard I want to work at it. And the answer is not that hard. Yes, the fingernail wire clipper method. All right, let's bring a meter in. And we'll see what we're just getting with some really bright LEDs on it. Hey, it's putting out 2.3 volts. You know what? I mean, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I mean, I'm I'm suitably impressed, and I think I might just keep the. Uh, keep that solar panel you know for for a buck is worth it for the solar panel alone well that's it for this got a rechargeable AAA and a solar panel and some shite if you like this please give me a thumbs up share it on social media and if you haven't subscribed yet what the heck are you waiting for and for all the people who just subscribed in the last couple days thank you so much see you next time